Hello all. Welcome to this session. In this session, I am going to answer software testing interview question 334. That is, what is L10N testing? Let me answer. L10N testing is nothing but localization testing, guys. Okay, why it is called as L10N testing? Because in between the letters L and N, in localization, if you see, first letter is L, right? And the last letter is N. N. And in between that, how many letters are there? 10 letters are there. That's why L10N. You can, in short, localization testing can be called as L10N testing. Okay, don't get surprised if someone asks you well, what is L10N testing. It's simple, nothing but localization testing, guys. Okay. But what is localization testing or this L10N testing? Testing performed for checking the localized version of a product. Okay. You are checking a localized version of a product which works for a specific culture or locality. Let's say there is a particular software which is okay, which is specifically designed for Japanese people. Okay, the people who are speaking Japanese language for those people to make their uh, using of the software easy and uh, because they prefer using the software in Japanese. You created a software. Okay, your company has created a or developed a software for a specific locality or culture or language. Okay, so if you are testing such kind of applications which are specially designed or developed for a specific culture, locality or language, okay, that testing is called as localization testing or Ltanian testing. Examples let me give guys, okay, Windows operating system. Everyone know Windows operating system. Okay, this Windows operating system is provided by Microsoft company. Okay, if you examine my Windows operating system here, all the options are coming in English, right? You see Edward and everything. You see type here to search. Everything is coming in English. Okay, whatever you do here, all the things are coming in English, guys, right? Everything is displayed in English language here. Such documents, everything is there in English language. But do you know that the same Microsoft company has developed or designed a Windows operating system specific for Japan people who speak Japanese language, okay? Who want to use the same Windows operating system in Japanese language, okay? So I'll show you a snapshot of that. Here I already opened. Just see here, guys. This is how the Windows operating system, which is a localized version for Japanese language. So that all the people in the Japan prefer using uh, their uh, Windows operating system in Japan language rather than in English, okay? So more more people will use, okay? Now because of this a facility provided to the Japanese language uh, usage people, okay, uh, Microsoft is adding more people into the bucket, right? Because some people may be reluctant to use Windows operating system just because uh, the they don't know English. But now since they have created localized version in Japanese language, now there will be some set of people who will start using Windows operating system for that purpose. The market will increase for them, right? Similarly, Korean, okay? So the people who speak Korean, also a localized version environment Windows operating system is created. This is an example, guys, okay? If you are testing such kind of software, okay, whatever the software Windows operating system, which are just now, I showed you as an example in Japanese and, uh, and built on uh, Korean languages, right? If you are testing such kind of applications, okay, we call that testing as L10N testing, that is localization testing. I have also performed L10N testing as a, Basically, this is common in when you are uh, testing desktop applications, right? Okay, so you will come across a lot of, uh, you will come across English one first. After English, you will come as Japanese, Korean, okay? Lot of will be there, guys, okay? Spanish and all those uh, localized environments will be there. So it this generally happens in uh, desktop applications the most of the times, okay? Fine. Fine. Now, so what is the benefit? I already mentioned the benefit of the localization, right? Uh, what is the benefit of localization? I'm not saying what is the benefit of localization testing. So the Microsoft company by lo by creating a localized environment for Windows operating system for Japanese language and Korean language. What is the benefit? The company will get more people. Okay, more people are going to use the software or adapt the software. Okay, the people who you don't expect to use the software also will use the software now. Okay, the market reach will rise. Okay, and that's the reason they are creating this localized environments or developing the localized environments. And that is the reason we are getting an opportunity as software tester to test such kind of localized environments. Okay, so fine. 
So hope guys you understood what is uh, localization testing that is L10 and testing where we test the localized versions of the okay software okay which are designed for a specific culture language region locality etc okay so that's all for this session in the next session i'm going to answer another software testing interview question for you till then see you bye bye